In the Create a Map for Geological Data Collection blog post, you created a mineral collection map for a field-based lab activity. Before heading to the field, you'll configure your map for use in field maps. Using the Field Maps web app, you'll add a thumbnail image, configure the form used for data collection, and create an offline map area. First, we'll add a custom image that will be used as the map's thumbnail. The thumbnail will help students identify the map in the Field Maps mobile app. First, open ArcGIS Online or Enterprise and sign in to your account. Click Content, and on the Content page, select the Mineral Collection Lab map. The Details page for the map will open, and in the right panel, select Open in Field Maps. The Maps Overview page will open in the Field Maps web app. Click the map thumbnail and change it to an image of the location of your field collection. Now, your students will be able to more easily identify the map in the mobile app. While in the field, students will collect data on the minerals they find by filling out a form in field maps. The form will contain the fields we added earlier to our layer, such as mineral type, locality, field notes, etc. We will configure the form so it has the proper layout and includes the form entries students will need to fill out. In the left panel, click Content to open the content page. Under Editable Layers, click the Mineral Collection layer. The blank form canvas opens and this is where you'll configure the form that students will use when collecting data in the mobile app. In the right panel, the attributes list shows all the attributes that can be used as entries in the form. The list includes the fields added earlier in the mineral collection layer. Drag the collector name, collection date, locality, mineral type, specimen label, and field notes attributes onto the form. You can drag attributes one at a time or control click to select and move them all at once. Additionally, drag any other fields you created onto the form. Next, click the mineral type attribute. The properties panel opens displaying formatting options for the attribute. Under input type, select radio buttons. This will display the mineral types as radio button options within the form. Next, click the field notes attribute. In the description text box, Add additional context for the type of field notes students should add while collecting specimens. Here's an example. This sentence will show up as a hint suggestion students can read to better fill out their field notes. Next, click the form title and change it to Mineral Collection Form. Your form should look something like this when completed. When participants collect data in the Field Maps mobile app, this form will appear. Students will fill out the entries added to the form along with any other custom fields you may have added. Click Save to save your form. If you will be collecting minerals in an area with no data connection, you will need to create an offline map area that students can download on their mobile device and collect data on without an internet connection. If you will be working in an area with a data connection, you can skip these steps. To create your offline map area, in the left panel, click Offline, and on the Offline page, click Map Areas. Next, click Manage Areas to start creating the offline map area, then select Create Area. For name, type Mineral Collection Area. Use the Sketch Rectangular Map Area tool to draw a rectangle over the area where you will be collecting minerals. Finally, click Save. Once the map area is done packaging, it will be available for students to download when they open the map in Field Maps. Next, let's share the map. In the side panel, click Sharing to open the Sharing page. Click Set Sharing Level to share the map with the accounts your participants will use when collecting data using the Field Maps mobile app. You can share the map to your entire organization or to a group you created for this lab. Once you share your map and layer, 
you and your class are ready to download the Field Maps mobile app and begin collecting minerals in the field. This video is the second part of the Collect Geological Data with Field Maps Discovery Path. To learn how to make the map we configured in this video, check out the Create a Map for Geological Data Collection blog post. Now that you have made and configured the map, check out the Collect Geological Data in the field using ArcGIS Field Maps video to learn how to collect mineralogical data in the Field Maps mobile app. To see the full path, visit the Collect Geological Data with Field Maps Discovery Path page. Links to all resources can be found in the description box below. Music